last council meeting, we had several people come up and say, if you can spay and neuter and demand that uh, the bulls be spay and neutered, that, you should, that should be across the board. I disagree with that. Uh, my focus, uh, it still is, on specifically on breed specific, and that is pit bulls. Uh, and you've all heard me uh, explain why I think pit bulls need to be spayed and neutered. Last year we had a, I believe she was eight years old, I'll tell you again, uh, lady go out to get her mail and she was attacked by a pit bull. <clears throat> Not to mention the children that have been attacked, even in, as a pet. That's the turn on their turn on uh, I've seen too many of them. Uh, it's a grotesque sight to see a little child tore up by a dog. And the problem with pit bulls, <clears throat> and again, I'll, I'll state this, I've been bit by dogs. Um, dogs will bite you and go away normally, or bite you and release. Pit bulls will not release once they bite. And not only that, they will take and uh, attempt to tear that object that they have in their mouth. And they'll just rip their heads back and forth. So <clears throat> I still stand strong on a uh, breed specific in reference to pit bulls only. Uh, if somebody wants to uh, spay and neuter their own dogs, that's fine. But as far as the ordinance goes, uh, I'm pretty clear on it. I think I'm clear on uh, my intentions for bringing this up in the first place. Most everybody is, is for voluntary spay and neuter. All my dogs are spayed and neutered. Educating, uh, making things more affordable, more accessible, and lifting communities up. Everybody's behind that. Um, this legislation is not that. Um, this legislation is based on the false premise that all pit bulls are vicious and a detriment to public safety. Um, that's what this legislation comes out of. Uh, the state of California just disallows bans so this is what Robert Miller in the county of Riverside has left you guys with. Um, that's not my opinion. Mr. Goodland, with all due respect, came out and said in the media that he would prefer a ban. So that's, and he's the one that proposed the legislation. So this isn't about spay and neuter. This is about banning pit bulls, which you can't do. So the second best option is to uh, spay them all or neuter them all so they kind of um, cease to exist basically in a generation or two. My original thought on the comment that was made that I uh, uh, that was in the uh, press enterprise about me, I would just like to get rid of them. Bam, period. In uh, in our city, true. I would like to do that, but it's against the law to do that. So guess what? I'm not going forward. 